Ooh, ooh. Let's go. Let's go. Boot camp. Boot camp. I'm just kidding. This ain't no exercise boot camp. Military. Let's get it. All right, listen. Tonight I'm talking about making some money, all right? Money in any situation. This is a regardless opportunity, all right? You got me doing my little robot dance with it. <laughs> this is a regardless opportunity, all right? So, what I want y'all to know is that this opportunity is going to position you to create wealth regardless of what your regardless of what's going on in the world, right? A lot of people are not exposed to financial freedom, the truth of it, because they don't know the right information, all right? So guys, on tonight, my name is B. Burrell. If somebody invited you, if you just came across this feed, listen, I want to thank you for taking time out of your schedule to join me on the night, all right? I'm out of breath because I just ran downstairs, <laughs> all right? So... The first thing I want you guys to do, if you haven't been on the feed, go back to the past five days, all right? We've been doing the boot camp for five days in a row. This is the fifth and final episode, guys, all right? So start from Monday, go down my feed. I'm going to tell you the things that you're going to learn. Day one, we went over mindset. You see, you only attract who you are. You attract what you think about, right? So you have to understand mindset is first. It doesn't matter this opportunity, this education, this, this knowledge that I'm sharing, guys. It doesn't work if you don't become intentional about where you want to go. You want to write this down. The difference between a rich and wealthy and a poor and middle class is one word. Goals, second word, is discipline. Goals is giving yourself an aim. What do you want, right? My goal for this month is to actually have $5,000 residual income, passive income, right? Hitting my bank account every single month. After that, it's 10,000. Trading account, 100K flat, right? So goal, the difference between a rich and wealth and a poor and middle class is that they set goals. You have to understand that. Think about this. When was the last time you set a goal and went after it? When was the last time you, you set a goal and actually went after it? You didn't just wake up to an alarm clock and doing a regular morning routine but you sat down and got a pen and paper. God said, write the, write the vision to make it plain. When was the last time you wrote the vision for yourself? When was the last time you prayed over that vision? When was the last time you gave it to God and said, God, I'm gonna work with you on making this vision come to life? That's the difference between the rich and wealthy and poor and middle class. Now, they don't have to be God faith, but they understand the laws. You attract what you think about. You become what you think about. They understand the laws, right? Secondly, you have to have discipline. The misconception is, is that discipline is when you get punished for something. But discipline is the road to freedom. Discipline is the road to wealth. Discipline is the road to living the life that you imagine, not the life that you daydream about. Not the life that you wish, not the life that you hope, but the, the life that you set a goal to achieve. All right? Discipline is not punishment. The definition of discipline, guys, you want to write this down. The ability to give myself a command and follow it. That's discipline. The ability to give myself a command and follow it, right? How many guys wish you could wake up and go to, to the gym in the morning? I'm one of them, <laughs> right? How many guys say you're going to wake up and go walk down the street for 30 minutes? How many guys have you said, I'm actually going to save some income. I'm going to put aside 10 to 15% of my income so I can save some money. Or you say you're going to put more time and you're going to, whatever it is, you lack the commitment. You lack the ability to give yourself a command and follow through with it. That means you lack discipline. And if you can't talk to yourself, if you can't tell self what to do, guess what? Self is going to be in the same situation. So that was day one. Your mindset has to be able to attract wealth and riches. All right? This is what most people have. A poor mindset. What does poor mindset mean? Passing over opportunities repeatedly. Being broke is temporary. I've been broke before. Right? I've been broke before. I know what it looks like to not have no money. I know what it feels like. But guess what? This is what I don't possess. A poor mentality. One thing I know is that when I lose it, I can get it right back. But I learned from why I lost it in the first place so I never have to go back and try to get it again. Right? See, most of us find ourselves in a circle. We lose it. We lose it. We get it. We lose it. So many Americans right now are about to receive a stimulus check. I guarantee you the next 30 days is going to be at ground zero. It's almost going to be like they never received the check. Because what most people are taught to do is spend. 
I want you guys to know this. Most people plan. They literally take out a sheet of paper. They write down how much they're getting. And they write down subtract signs allowed down the list. There's a subtraction sign down the left side of the piece of paper determining what you're about to spend. What we don't do is get that piece of paper and say, where's that money going to grow? Where's that money going to multiply? Where's that money going to go to work for me? Because y'all got to understand this. The word end is a spend. So if you have a habit of spending, it's always going to come to an end. Your money has to make you more money. All right? If it's not saving you money or making you money, you're always going to be at a dead end. All right? If you work a job and only have one stream of income, you're going to work a job for the rest of your life. 71% of Americans live paycheck to paycheck. Right? The divorce rate has went up 50%. I mean, 13%. Right? Because people can't even get along, right? But over, what, 40% of marriages fail because of money. Some people may actually get along. But money causes tension. Why? Don't be the person to say, I don't need money. I got everything I need. No, you don't. Because if you say that, you're telling God you, you, you don't need anymore. If you say that, you tell God, I want to appreciate you. But I'm going to go ahead and cap these blessings. Think about that. I don't want more. I'm good with what I got. That's a slap in the face to God because he is telling you, I want overflow, abundance for your life. But you tell him, bro, I'm good with what you gave me. Right? You should never be satisfied. Right? Because he's seeking to express himself through you. He's seeking to express his, his abilities, his creativity, his overflow and abundance. He wants you to be a testimony. But what you keep doing is ending it. Right? Money. Why do you need money? How many of y'all got to eat? All right? How many people love to eat? I'm a foodie. I love to eat. Ooh, I love to eat. My sister can throw down, y'all. My sister, my cutie pie. And when I travel, food be busting. Right? Check this out. You need money so you can eat. There would be no need for charities. There would be no need for donations if we didn't need money. Right? If we would actually teach that money should never be an issue, maybe there would be no need for charity. There will be no need for a paper bag sack once a year. We should actually give people the right information. What we're doing is teaching the wrong information. It's okay to have a job. There's nothing wrong with having a job, but the wrong, the problem is guys having one stream of income. That's the point of this call on tonight. The problem is that I know a lot of people that 6 million Americans just filed for unemployment. But guess what? The problem didn't start today. The problem didn't start when, when this pandemic arrived. I'm going to tell you when the problem started. The problem started long ago. <laughs> the problem started when you got your first job. The problem started when you when you entered into college. The problem started when everybody was born. Let me tell you why. The problem started when you was born because till date you still don't know what financial freedom is. That means there's a cycle, there's a disconnect when everybody is born and everybody born is born illiterate and everybody dies illiterate. That's the disconnect. Money, it pays your bills. How many of y'all got bills? Drop them in the chat box if you got bills. Matter of fact, drop in the chat box what bills you got. Because we're going to get into what is behind me. But what is behind me won't work if you leave it behind you. Mm. Right? So you have to understand. A lot of people see opportunity. But they leave it behind them. So drop in the chat box if you got bills. Or tell me all them bills. Alright? Now if some of y'all got some kind of bills we won't even know about, then put that in the chat box. <laughs> Card well, tell note. me what bills you got. Card note. Card note. Hold on, I can't see. What else y'all Cell got? phone. Cell phone. Not a click kid, including the other kids' phone. Rent, car insurance, phone. Too many. <laughs> <laughs> Too many bills. Rent, mortgage. All the insurance is medical, life, dental, renters. Somebody what else? What else? Did I miss one? What bill, I do what bill don't I have? Student loan debt. Kids. I can write. This 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 whiteboard would be filled up if I write down every bill that everybody got. Right? Kids. We can put mortgage, we can put electric, we can put gas, we can put medical insurance, dental insurance, kids, dental insurance, and medical insurances. Children, clothes, food, shelter, uh, gas bill, trash bill, light bill, phone bill, pay my bills. I'm about to start singing songs. So we can take so can everybody agree. That if I write out the bills, we're gonna fill up this whiteboard. Yes, one for yes, right? Two for no. If I write out all the bills that we got, we're gonna fill up this whiteboard. One for yes, two for no. 
Right? Let me know when I get a one. Okay. Right? So then. Got some. It. Boom. <laughs> so we know we're going to fill up this whiteboard. But let me ask y'all this. How many income streams do you got? Are we gonna fill up the income? We gonna fill up the whiteboard with income streams? Huh? Crickets. Bills over here. We got a whole bunch on. That's a lot. I can't write on the bills up, right? Bills over here. But if I write down income, first of all, you have to know the different types of income, right? How long is that list gonna be? We got down to two? Three. Three. It's between one 71%, and two. 71%, seven out of 10 people on this call living paycheck to paycheck. So it ain't gonna go past one for too long. All right? That's why I'm here tonight, guys. How many of y'all would like to be in a financial position that you'll make money whether you sleep, you'll make money regardless of what's going on, you'll make money when the markets are crashing, you'll make money when the markets are dashing. What's the other, what's the other rain deal? So, <laughs> You'll make money, right? How many of y'all are interested in learning how to create wealth regardless of what's going on around you? How many people are interested in creating wealth regardless of what's going on around you? Right? What if a check was still coming to you? What if you was in total control of your money regardless of what the bank says, regardless of what the world says, regardless of what Trump says, your money is not affected. Right? Your money is not affected. You want a regardless type of income. Whew. He want a regardless type of income. How does that go? Hey, B, how's your day going? How's everything going on in your world? Oh, I'm good regardless. Hey, B, I heard some bad news on the news last night. Are you okay? Oh, I'm good regardless. Hey, who else? Who, give me a name out of the chat box. Who's somebody in the chat? Charles Platt. Charles Platt. Mr. Platt. Mr. Platt, I'm sorry to inform you. Uh, right now is not the best time for us to keep you on staff. What if you could reply, it's all right, I'm good regardless. <laughs> Woo! See, that ain't just faith, baby. That's knowing the right information. See, God got me regardless. But what if you got you regardless too? What if you could get a partnership with God on a regardless type of way? Come on now. So this is a regardless type of situation. What if you wanted to leave your job and embark on your goals and your dreams? How many of y'all got goals? How many of y'all got something y'all want to build? You got business ideas, inventions. You got gifted children, talented children, right? How many of you guys want to be able just to travel the world for one year and not worry about nothing? Guess what? This opportunity can do that. Because it's a regardless, regardless opportunity. All right, I hope y'all dancing on y'all end because I'm feeling amazing because what I'm giving right now ain't for everybody. What I'm giving right now is remember the mindset. Day two, we talked about this. This is called MetaTrader 4. It's a trading software. Tonight's call is about how you can trade in different financial markets. A lot of people hear Forex all the time. That ain't nothing but a little taint. I'm Southern, taint, little, little taint of seasoning, right? You can trade in different financial markets, Forex, cryptos, Indices, Dow Jones, futures, options, stocks. We got it all. What you want, I got it. What you want, I got it. Hey, hey. I got it. I got it. Right? That's what y'all want to understand. <laughs> That's what I have for you is a financial vehicle that will allow your goals to stop collecting dust. I have a financial vehicle that will allow your business ideas to stop collecting dust. I have a financial vehicle for you to stop working so darn hard. Being overworked. Underpaid. Anybody ever felt overworked before? Please drop a one to check boss for me, Steve. Anybody ever felt overworked with no return? Sweat equity with no return. Sweat zero equity. Anybody ever felt overworked before? Anybody ever felt underpaid before? Mm. I'm talking about putting in work and underpaid. Underpaid. I'm talking about UNDA. Under, right? Anybody ever felt stressed before? All right? Irritated. I gotta go here today, right? Nothing wrong with jobs. Only wrong with one stream of income. 85% of Americans hate what they do. Y'all see these numbers? These numbers are huge. All right? So what I want you guys to realize tonight, 
Go back to day one, two, three, or four. That's your homework. And get educated on why I spent my life every these past five days, over an hour each day, breaking this down. Because what I'm doing is economical ministry. All right, modern day Harriet Tubman in front of you. Now, this is not going to work. Remember, if your mindset is not right, because Harriet Tubman couldn't have freed those slaves who didn't know they was a slave. Mm. She couldn't have freed people who were in a crisis when they didn't know they were in the crisis. So, I planted the seed, but it's, you, it's up to you for your belief to nurture. Here we go. Meditator 4 is what you want to download. How did Mark keep getting that? This is the trading software. All right? This is the trading software, MetaTrader 4. You access so many different financial markets, okay? I went over how to make money. I'm going to do that one more time. I don't know how we get paid on a drop. I'm going to show you guys how we get paid on a drop. I'm going to show you guys how we get paid on a pop. <laughs> I just wonder around. All right? To access this financial market, you first have to become educated, and that's what I'm here to teach you guys. This boot camp is not a I'm going to learn how to trade session. This boot camp is an introduction to show you what you've been missing out on. All right? MetaTrader 4 is a software that allows us to multiply our income in different financial markets, whether the markets are dropping, whether the markets are falling, I mean, are climbing. All right? Stock market is a totally different financial vehicle. Yes, we can leverage stocks in what I do with day trading, but possession of an asset is not what I do. I make money off a fluctuation of price. Say it again. Write that down. Day trading is not... Is not... Stock market holding shares. I make money off a of fluctuation of price. I make money off of something rising and falling. Y'all, anybody ever bought an airplane ticket before? Drop a one in the chat box. Anybody ever bought an airplane ticket before? Or you ever search for airplane prices? Right? Does an air flight... Air flight tickets uh, fluctuate in price all the time, right? Gas prices fluctuate, but it's a little bit slower than the airline ticket, right? Guess what? If you can predict where price is going, you can get paid. How many of y'all like that? That sounds good, thing. They do. If you can predict where price is going, you can get paid. Wow. I need to write that down. What I do, predict where price it's going. If I get it right, cha-ching, I get paid. If I predict what your stock share is going to go to, I get paid. If I predict that your stock going to drop 40%, I get paid. If I predict that something's going to drop, I get paid. The reason I'm putting emphasis on drop because you cannot be biased in this market. A lot of people are like, I don't understand how you get money on the sale. I'm trying to explain it to you if you would listen. Right? Two totally different entities. Seafood, well, I can't say seafood. <laughs> Italian food don't taste like soul food. Two totally different categories. Barbecue don't taste like, well, if you throw some barbecue sauce, but barbecue don't taste like Italian. Two totally different tastes. Same type of food, same same um, uh, market, if you will. Food, 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 but different tastes. This is food, but different tastes. All right? But this one, you always gonna eat. This one you always won't eat, baby. All right? Let me show you guys something. So this is the MetaTrader 4 app. All right? For you guys who missed the classes, just a quick rundown. It's on the left side of the screen. It's called Pairs. Okay? We get to trade any market. So these are six letters. All right? And those six letters represent a currency. AUD represents Australia. AUD represents Australia. USD represents the US dollar. CAD represents the Canadian dollar. All right, there's so many of them. Uh, what I miss? GBP, pound, British pound. Okay, I just went to London last month. Well, month, well, the beginning of, I went to London. End, end of March, beginning of, yeah, beginning of the yeah, beginning last month, and right before everything started getting crazy, uh, I had to exchange my U.S. dollars for a British pound. They charged me. This is the charge, y'all. I flew to London, and in the, in the uh, airport in Detroit. I went to the foreign exchange desk. Every single airport has a foreign exchange desk. If you've ever cashed a check before at a check cashing place, they charge you a fee. That's called the check cashing fee. This is called the exchange rate fee. 
If you want to get my U.S. dollars and I want to get your pounds, I'm going to put you, I'm going to tax you on that. Nothing is for free, right? Pound to U.S. dollar, the exchange rate was $1.22. All right? U.S. to a Canadian dollar is $1.42. All right? Euro versus the Czech, Australia, all these are pairs. All right? If I scroll down some more. Gold versus the U.S. dollar. The exchange rate to the, for um, a Virgo is $1,600. All right? Bitcoin versus the USD. These are indices. This is what you guys see a lot on the news all the time. Dow Jones, NAS 100, SPX 500. All right? US 30. These are the top US 30 companies in the United States. Guess what? If this drops from 2100 to 20... Oh, you know what? Let me give y'all an example. Here we go. How do we get paid? Y'all ready to find out how we get paid? Let me show you how we make money on the drop. Drop a one for yes if you're trying to figure out how in the world do we get paid on these exchange rates? One for yes in the chat box. If you want to know how we get paid on all these exchange rates. All right? We got a one yet. Mm-hmm. So let me teach y'all something. I'm not going to even talk about four rates. So I'm going to talk about indices right quick. Because I need y'all mind to get right. U.S. 30, the top 30 country companies in the United States. Google it. Go to CNBC. Go to Bloomberg. Exchange rate. We're going to say this. It's at 21000 right now. If this drops to $20,000, somebody drop in the chat box, what's the difference between $21,000 and $20,000? What's the difference between 21,000? If this drops from 21 to 20, what's the difference in those numbers? All right? I'm waiting. 1K. Okay. <laughs> $1,000. Okay? Now I wrote this too big because I need some space to break this down for y'all. I'm going to write it right back. We said 21. 21,000 down to 20,000. The difference in that price fluctuation, the difference in movement predicting where price will go is $1,000. Now, we don't say dollars in the trading world. We don't say dollars. Okay, I'm gonna keep it simple. We're gonna say 1,000 pips. Actually, we're gonna 10,000 pips, but we'll leave it off. We're going to say a thousand pips. Let's keep it simple. Because we count currency exchange rates based off of the smallest decimal space, which gives us a higher, I don't know where, a higher uh, return of our investments, if you will. All right? So if you guys said, if you said the NZDJPY would go from 63 to 62, Y'all would call it a dollar. We call it a hundred. Okay? So every hole equals a dollar. I'm not really going to break this math down because it's way more than a thousand pips, but I'm going to keep it simple. So we just know, we just, just notice we don't call it dollars, we call it pips. Okay? A thousand pips. Now, everybody on the call, if you got a dollar to your name, one USD dollar, drop a one in the chat box. If you got a dollar, let me know. I need to know who got a dollar they can invest right quick. Give me a dollar out your bank account. Give me a dollar out from underneath the couch. If you got a dollar, let me see a dollar in the chat box, right? Somebody got a dollar. All right, I need ten dollars. I mean ten ones before I go forward. One, okay. One, two, three. Who gonna give me a dollar? What's up, Instagram? How y'all feeling tonight? Okay, we got ten ones. All right, bet. What's up, Facebook? I appreciate y'all joining in too, because I know this is your time, and time is the, the biggest asset. It's something we can't get back. So I thank y'all for tuning in. I'm gonna send y'all some love. So a thousand tips, ladies and gentlemen. Mm -hmm. Everybody got their dollar ready? I wish I had a dollar down here, right? I want you to invest that dollar to the market. Take it out your pocket, give it away. What you're saying is. I want to take this money out of my broker account and I want to invest it into the market. Back. If this dollar goes in my prediction, I'm going to get paid. That's it. Meaning, if this market drops 1,000 moves, aka pips, I'm going to get paid. It drops 1,000 pips, 
I'm going to get paid. So, how much am I going to get paid is the question. For every single pip, it drops. You just made a dollar. Let's say it again. For every single pip, don't call it a dollar, we don't call it dollars. For every single pip, it drops, you made one dollar USD. So, my favorite people on the call right now, if it dropped 1,000 pips and I just gave you the formula for how much money you just made, how much money did you make if you put a dollar in the market? For every single pip it drops, you made a dollar. If, if it dropped 1,000 pips, how much money did you make? How much money did you make? All right? Somebody said money. Y'all got to know. A, a thousand. Somebody said a thousand. A thousand dollars. Who got it right? Miss Jules. Miss Jules. Tia. Let's celebrate. She just made a thousand dollars. Let's Beverly. celebrate. Who else? Beverly Charles. Beverly. You got it right. Y'all celebrate. I hope y'all celebrate because this is a real reality. The source of the source. The source of the source. This is a real truth. I'm celebrating your future right now. Write the vision and make it plain. You catch the formula, you don't get paid. Cause I gotta teach you though. I gotta teach you what we call the charts. Okay? I'm gonna bring that back down if I start dancing on y'all. So let's put it into a chart formation. <laughs> let's put it in a chart. Where my red mark is. Can they see the chart? Y'all can see the bottom of the chart? Mm -hmm. Top side is 21,000. Bottom side is 20. 20 to 21. 20 to 21. Y'all got an Instagram? I'm coming for you. The top peak is a 21 gram. The lower peak is 20K. 20 dot. It starts up. We're talking about US 30 in a chart formation. It said 20 gram. It goes to 21. You go back down about 25, 20,005, midway. Goes back up to 21, 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21. What is it going to next? 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21, 20, 21. Give it to me. Y'all yeah, give it to me. What is it going to next? What's the bottom? What's the valley? That's the peak. That's the valley. That's the peak. What's the valley? Come on. 20. 20. Who got it right? 20. Tierra. Me Wiggins. Tierra. Let's celebrate. That's what we do. We look at the history of price fluctuations to predict what's going to happen. All I'm doing is looking at y'all spending habits. This is nothing but money moving. Humans are creatures of, uh, what is it? Creatures have, what is this thing? Creatures of habit. Creatures of habit, right? So I'm just looking at the habits. I look at charts, y'all. People have been, people been spending, the, the exchange rate's been in the same space for 10 years. I be like, man, it's been doing this thing for 10 years. USDK, I can bring it up and show you, right? So since we're gonna predict that this is going to drop, 1,000 pips, you're going to choose your number out of your bank account, out of your brokerage account. You got to go to a broker. Think of it as your bank account, though. How much money are you going to invest into this opportunity if you drop 1,000 pips? Does it make sense, see? It does. How much do you want to invest since you're going to predict that it's going to drop 1,000 pips? Give me your number. What's your, what's your number? Don't do a dollar no more. What's your number now? Since you, you should get the concept. How much do you want to invest if this market drops in your favor? $2, $5, 10 cents. 30. Somebody said $30. Somebody trying to get paid. Give 20. me a number. <laughs> what is that? 20 and a dollar. 
Perfect. Ten dollars. Y'all got big dreams. So if somebody invested thirty dollars, guess what? What the? <laughs> thirty times a thousand is what? Thirty times one thousand is what? If this bad boy drop, every pill you making a you making thirty dollars. For every pill you making a whew, for every pill you making thirty dollars. Do y'all understand the market can drop a thousand pips in fifteen minutes? The market can drop. You spent you trading US thirty. It can drop nine thousand pips in an hour. Thirty k. Thirty k is your pay day. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Who kept? Who kept? Thirty k pay day. Who kept? Who kept? 30K, pay day. Hey, hey. Yo way, yo way, yo way, yo way, yo way, yo way, yo way. <laughs> right? We gotta keep this thing fun, y'all. But let's bring it down, cause I want y'all to, I want y'all to get a hump beyond yourself right now. I want you to invest between ten cents and, and fifty cents. Let's stay there. Choose your number: ten cents, twenty cents, thirty cents, forty cents, or fifty cents. Pick your number. 10, 20, 30, or 50 cents. What's your number? Pick one. Drop it in the chat box. What you investing? 20. Somebody 20, said 20 cents? 20 cents. All right. Who else? Give me one more. 20 30 cents, cents again. 30 cents. 20 Perfect. 50 cents. We're going to stop there. Y'all can use your calculator. So, based off of history... We're going to predict this opportunity is going to drop a thousand pips. One thousand pips. If it goes in your favor, you're going to grab your phone. Bring up the phone. Let me bring up the phone right quick. This is how you place the trade. You make an analysis and you place the trade. Okay? So, you're going to go to US 30. Okay? Can Instagram see the Metroid phone? They said it was fuzzy last night. Give a good old zoom. You can zoom in on it. Yeah, the bottom one. So how does what how does that whiteboard convert into this app? You look at an analysis. Let's come here. What's US 30? US 30 is right here. Okay. I'm gonna press on this chart to bring up the chart. Alright. I'm going to predict. Matter of fact, we can predict it's gonna shoot up a thousand pips, by the way. Alright, but we ain't gonna do that. Let's pretend you caught you was trying to catch this drop. This drop is a thousand pips. More than that, in real, and not really, really. But we're going. This is a thousand pip drop. Let's pretend this is you at the top of this drop. All right. So let's do this. Ooh, it's like get. Ooh, give me what I needed. This ain't even intentional. Y'all already know it looking like this. It went up, hit the line. It went up, hit the line. Oh. Oh, okay, wait, it changed my thing. Here we go, let me give it to you. Went up. It spiked and hit the line, and then it dropped. It went up, spiked and hit the line, and then it dropped. It went up, it's going to spike and hit the line, and then what, y'all? Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop, drop, drop it like it's hot. We make money. Drop it like it's hot. They off analysis. Drop it like it's hot. Guys, this stuff is really predictable. I'm not playing no games with y'all. I retired two years ago from my job because I decided that this is what makes sense to me. What didn't make sense was that I was angry every time my alarm clock went off. What didn't make sense was that I was not getting paid my work. What didn't make sense is that I stayed knowing that I didn't get paid my work. Oh, my word. Sell, 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 so we know we gotta press sell. So you come to your app, your software, this is connected, your real money is on this app, by the way. You, you deposit your income through a broker to this app. You will press trade in the top right hand corner. This is where price is currently at. The 21,000, we think it's gonna drop down to 20,000. So what we would do, is we would say, take me out in profit at the number 20,000. So I'm gonna put 20,000 right here. 
The market is currently closed, by the way, so I can't actually place the trade. All right? Wait, 21,000. <laughs> oh, that's 210,000. Mm -hmm. Point zero zero. Here we go. So that says, take me out of profit at 21,000. But what if it doesn't drop this time? What if it goes in your? What if it goes against your prediction? You can also be in full control of your losses. This is the kick. You can't be afraid to lose in this. You're already losing. Mm. If you got one stream of income. You can't be afraid of this. What if we can teach you to catch and predict this prediction? What if I can teach you to predict this eight out of ten times? How many I would mind winning? How many I would mind losing two times out of ten? Let me say it that way. You gotta get your mind right. How many I wouldn't mind losing two out of ten times? Drop a three in the chat box if that's you. Right? Your record is so high. At least 80-85% winning ratio. Mine is over 93. I've sent out a hundred over a hundred trades. Right? I tell people when to press sell a buy until they learn how to trade. I've sent out over a hundred trades in 2020. I've only lost four. Right? I'm actually gonna go back and count how many trades I've sent out. You've helped people get, make so much money, right? This is not to entice you guys. I'm trying to show you what you've been missing out because you don't want to learn it. Guess what? We're going to take us out of profit. So take me out automatically. The software is going to take you out automatically in profit when it drops down to 20,000, all right? Now, the stop loss means take me out automatically if it goes the wrong way. So if we enter in at 21,000, all right? Y'all remember that tip? You remember the pips? On the top side, you can say, you know what? If this goes up to 21,200, 21, take me out automatically at 21,200. All right? Because if you did 20 cents and 30 cents, all right, you're losing probably like uh, 20 bucks. Remember, if you invest, let me bring this down to 10 cents. So I'm going to use regular math on y'all right quick. If you invest the 10 cents into the market, okay? This means 10 cents, by the way. This is on my last feed. I talk about investment sizes. This row right here is how much you've invested into the market. This 0 0.01 means 10 cents. Let me slow down for y'all. This means 10 cents, okay? How much are you willing to lose? You got to know that number before you press these buttons. How much are you willing to lose? You can do that. You are in total, you're in total control of your losses. If you want to lose no more than $10, $20, $200, all you got to do is know what the pips is on the upside times your investment. So if I enter in at $2,100 and I say take me out at $21,200, I keep pressing the TV, $21,200, that means my $0.10, cents, once it goes from 2100 to twenty two to twenty one two, the difference in that number is $200. Remember, we don't call it dollars, we call it pips. 200 pips times your 10 cents is how much money you would lose before you get into a trade. You would know how much money you would lose before you get into a trade, excuse me. 200 pips going the opposite way of our prediction, but we invested 10 cents into the market. 200 pips the wrong way times my 10 cent investment equals $10. I mean, $200. Goodness gracious, it's $20, y'all, $20. 200 times 10 cents is 20 bucks. That means worst case scenario, before I put my money to work, I know because I'm not paying attention to this, this is a set and forget investment. Once I put my money to the market, I'm gonna go swimming. Mm -hmm. Once I put my money to the market, I'm gonna put my phone in airplane mode because I gotta catch a flight to LA. Mm. When I put my money to work, I'm about to go to sleep. I'm about to put my money to work and beat these kids behind because they run around the house tearing everything up. I don't have time to babysit this. This is not what I teach. I don't teach having another child. Whew. Mm. Right? I teach you how to put overalls and Timberland boots on your money to make money based off of fluctuation of price. If this goes the wrong way, you lost 20 bucks. Not a big deal. If you want to bring it down, you can say, you know what, B, I don't want to lose 20. I want to lose 10. Well, let's bring it on in. Or bring this down to and $21,100. So if we enter the trade at 2100 and it goes up, if it goes the wrong way, 100 pips. If it goes the wrong way, 100 pips, we're going for 1,000. But if it goes the wrong way, 100 pips. 100 pips times my little 10 cents right here at the top that I put into the market 
Worst case scenario, because I'm setting and forgetting and letting my money go to work. It's going to take me automatically out in the loss. If it goes that way, it's going to take me out automatically in the win. If it goes that way. The loss, worst case scenario, I'm losing $10. Worst case scenario, because 100 pips the wrong way. That's the stop loss. That's called stop my loss. Stop my loss. 100 pips the wrong way. All right, I put it at 21,100 for the luck to stop, to take me out of the interest, to take me out of the trade. That's, 10, that's a $10 loss. Now, for those of y'all who want to invest $1 into the market, we're going to change the investment size. That's called a lot size. All right, we're going to change the investment to $1. Now, this means $1. 0 0.10 means $1, ladies and gentlemen. All right? Instagram, y'all good? Drop some ones in the chat box. How y'all feeling on tonight? I hope y'all getting some value. What's up, Princess uh, Zia98? Alexis? Or Alexis, right? Facebook, how y'all feeling? They blind. Some old folks on Facebook. So, <laughs> 2100 would be the exit. I just need y'all to get the concept, okay? We will exit this trade at 2100, right? We're going to enter in at 20 grand. We're going to enter in at the number 2100. We're getting money all the way to two thousand to twenty thousand. That's a thought. That's a thousand dollar. I mean, it's a thousand pip drop. Anyway, forget all the lingo. Just follow me. You get to control your losses, ladies and gentlemen. All right. If you put a dollar in the market, now we're going up on our investment for y'all big ballers on the call because you don't need a lot of money to make a lot of money in these markets. By the way. All right. I know a guy who took a ten cent investment to over five figures. All right. I mean, a dollar investment to over five figures. All right. One dollar. Okay. 0 0.10. Go to my last post. I go over investment, lot size and stuff. 0 0.10. And I'm going, if I put a dollar into the market and I'm looking to catch a thousand pip drop, that would be a $1,000 return on our investment. But what if it doesn't go in our prediction? Y'all got to remember that. Don't be so focused on making money. Professionals focus on protecting their money. All right. So one dollar, you can say, hmm, out of all the money in my bank account, out of all the money in my brokerage account, how much money am I willing to lose before I tell my money to go to work for me? You got to know that number. We usually tell people no more than 3%, between 2 to two to 5 worst, worst case scenario. What that means is you lose no more than $3 per 100. I said it again. You got, we said we usually have a rule. Don't risk any more than 3 to $5 per 100. All right? So just keep that in mind. That's a little nugget y'all can write down. So then, if I put a dollar in though, you got to determine what you're willing to lose before you put your money to work. All right? If you're willing to lose $10, you can't do that on, man, really on US 30, but listen, that means $1 times 100 pips, you're willing to lose $100. The investment size, you got to think of it on both sides. Okay? Most people are like, oh, I put 10 cents in the market, I made, you know, 100 bucks. I put a dollar in the market, I'm going to make $1,000. Think about it in inverse all the time. All right? What if that $1 don't go to 1,000 pips? What if it goes the opposite way? That's why you got to minimize your risk. All right? Okay? So, worst case scenario, it's either going to be a $100 loss. That's it. If I, if I increase my investment to $2... Then it makes me have a $200 loss. The bigger the investment, the bigger the loss. That's that simple. But if you invest correctly, your gains can be exponential because it can move so many pips, guys. That's what you have to learn. Now, those are things that we teach you inside this academy. All right? Remember, go through the past five days and look at all the lessons I just taught. This is not for somebody who's scared. I, I don't have time to really deal with somebody who's scared of freedom. All right. Harry dealt with that. She left him alone. All right. Mm, left so him. I don't want to leave that, but I'm going to have to leave that until you just can grow into a decision. All right. But I'm really here to set people free. I want to know what it is, what your why is. All right. Remember, you're going to learn how to trade. You're going to know the terminology, the history. You're going to learn how to read a chart. This is the main question I get. Well, how do I do an analysis? You have to sign up with my educational platform. You got to learn how to read the chart. That's what I teach. How in the world did I only lose four trades this year? Because I know how to read an analysis. I know how to read people's habits. It's super predictable. Worst case scenario, I lose what I knew 
what was going to be lost before I got into the market. Right? I love generational wealth. That's the name of my community, guys. Generational wealth, they be sleeping like a mug making money. I remember when people first got started, they be like, man, you don't know, man, I'm scared to lose some money. You don't have to lose any money. Get in a practice account. You're going to get a demo account. If you download this app, it's automatically going to give you a practice account. It's a simulation of the real market. Fake money on the real market. There is no reason you should have to lose. All you got to do is get the skill set. You're not going to bring somebody off the street who got two busted knees and tell them to go to the NBA. <laughs> right? You're not going to get nobody who had their ankles broke the whole time to come over here and get signed up with the Warriors. No. Mm -hmm. They got to get the skills. They got to shoot them free. They got to do what Kobe did. They got to wake up every single morning and shoot for the skills. Shoot for the skills. Shoot for the skills so when they're on court, when they're in their real account, when they're in a real game, they can what? Score. You don't have to rush. In. This, ain't no, this ain't no rush to make money situation, y'all. I want y'all to know that. This is so money will never be an issue situation. This is a regardless situation. If you want long-term wealth, you got to put your time in. Right? I've never seen a broke person with time. I'm sorry. I've only seen broke people with time. But they don't have no money to enjoy it. Or they be broke and don't have no time. They're working like crazy. You're not meant to have two, three, four, five jobs. You need to learn the right information. Right? Let me check y'all real quick. 401ks. Let me educate, let me educate y'all real quick. If you have a 401k, I want you to go look. How much is declined? Because that's another vehicle. That's the stock market, mutual funds, right? They're investing your money into the stock market, which did what? Ta! It did what, B? It dropped. It dropped. Why do you only hear about the stock market? Be so the broker can make it so the. So the, uh, all these investment companies and firms know you don't want to learn, so they're making money off of ignorance. It's easy to just let my, my, my investment manager handle my accounts. I got a manager handle my accounts. Have you, when is the last time you looked at your account? Do you even understand your account? I know too many people that get ready to retire can't afford because they never looked at their account. These workers will make these investment firms are racking up on y'all. Y'all have to get educated, right? You know, it's nothing wrong with the stock market, right? You still get rich off of it. But it's a slow growth, and it only it loses when it drops. We don't lose when we drop unless our prediction is wrong. That's it. So guess what? Your 401k, what percentage did it climb? Decline. Your 401k, what are they even investing in? They could be investing into some some little stocks they know ain't gonna move, but you think you're gonna catch a bag because you because you don't want to learn. Let me tell y'all what's hard. Ignorance is hard. Being in the blind, being in the, being left in the blind is, it, in the, in the wind is, is, is hard. I know what hard is, right? What you got, B? <laughs> On that? Just trying to educate y'all. 401k. Do you know what's your balance? Do you know the percentage in the decline? Do you know, do you, are you tracking the gains? Right? The market is going to recover. It's not a big deal. Not worried about that. This is the best time to buy stocks right now because everything is low. Just so you know. Ain't no need to panic about nothing. This is the best time to create wealth because everything is low. This is the best time to probably go buy houses and all that. Right? Cryptos. But your, your investment account is at 100% risk because if this bad boy want to hit ground zero, you ain't got no smile on your face. I hate when I find out people were working 20, 30, 50 years of their life and they got like $50,000 in their 401k. You mean to tell me that's how they got for you? You 65 years old and healthy and strong and beautiful. What if you live to 85, 95? I got a lady in my church who's 107. Walk, talk, and ride her bike in the morning. She be standing up, hey y'all. That's what she get old, real. She get, her, she, her birthdays come around like clockwork. Guess what? How many of y'all gonna be able to live off of $50,000 for the next 10 years? All right? For the next 22 years. What is your yearly income? Somebody's yearly income is $50,000. Wait a minute. The average income in America is 57 to 60K with two people. Come on, B. The average income in America 
it's 57 to 60K with two people. Okay? So think about it. If you retire and this bad boy ain't at 50,000 no more and I'm dropped down to 35, how you gonna feel? Mm. I'm telling you, that's, that sucks. I'll be pissed off. Pensions don't exist no more. Only about 10, only about what, 10% of companies still do pensions at that? What's a pension? Don't worry about it. Ain't nobody paying you for it. All right? Pension is when the companies used to take care of you when you retired. 401ks actually replace pensions. Okay? Back in the 70s or 80s, 401ks came in and replaced pensions. And employers got tired of taking care of all these folks who were retiring. All right? They wanted to make it to the employee's responsibility. All right? Savings. How many people in the call got a savings account? Drop one in the chat box. If you got a savings account, drop one in the chat box. It's okay. How many of y'all got a savings account and ain't no money in? Don't, don't drop that. 71% of Americans live check to check. If they live check to check, there's no room to save. So at least 70% of people on the call may, may have opened one, but I guarantee the balance is below a thousand. Why? I want to say 70 something percent or 67 percent of Americans have, don't have a thousand dollars to their name. Can y'all tell me what we went wrong? Go to school, get good grades, get a good job and do what? Go to school, get good grades, get a good job and then what? Question mark. They ain't teach nobody how to set a dang goal. They just told us how to follow the leader. We're too busy following the rolling. Why are we, we, we busy studying how to earn money by just go get a degree? Nothing wrong with a degree, y'all. Something wrong with only having one stream of income. But ain't nobody told us how to study the rich and wealthy. We're too busy trying to be envy. We're trying to be jealous. Why are you being jealous of somebody rich and wealthy? Why are you being envious of somebody? Why are you being pissed off? Why are they walk around with money to their ear? Why are they buying all them done chains? Why are they buying all these gold teeth? Why are they buying all these expensive cars? Why Jeff Bezos go buy this, this, this condo in Miami? He need that. This man used to work in a basement. Amazon started off selling books only. I remember when Amazon first came out. Like, I was young, right? He realized he needed to set a goal and go for it until without end. He would put, he staked his life on making sure that goal happened. This is the issue. Do y'all understand that Jeff Bezos was created by the same thing? God created him, he created you. The only difference is Jeff Bezos has realized his power and he's using it. To be jealous of somebody is ignorant. To be envious of somebody is ignorant. Because they have the same power, the same ability. They use a bathroom the same way, I hope. They wash and take a shower the same way, I hope, right? We both eat and we poop. People have realized their abilities and the poor middle class choose to, to not tap into it. They choose to have excuses. They choose to follow the system. Wake up and see what's not working so you don't have to be wondering what you're going to be. I need you to go to 80 years old. Go to 85 tonight and look and think in reverse. Go to the age 85 and think in reverse. All right? Nobody can say it. That was the point of that. <laughs> All right? Social Security. Boy, that bad thing about to dry up like a prune in the sunshine. Dry up like the ash on the back of my feet. Let me tell y'all something. <laughs> Social Security. Basically, every time you get paid, they take some of your little money and they put it into a big pot, piggy bank. The big old pot. That pot is to help somebody get paid once they retire. It's like an automatic check. The funny thing about this check, you get, you take, they take, <laughs> this is the biggest, this is, this is what the biggest scam is. It's so funny, it's impressive because we all do it. You get paid, they take out Social Security and Medicare. Y'all see them little, them little things on the side of y'all, hey, look at that. Medicare taking out so much money. Why are they taking out all these taxes? You get paid, they take out taxes. You retire either at 72. If you do it earlier, they tax you on that. 70 or 75. <clears throat> when you retire, you get a social security check if it still exists when you get older. Because not, a lot of, not enough people are paying into social security no more. It's a lot of entrepreneurs and stuff. So then, when you get paid for social security, guess what? They take taxes again! 
You get double taxed. And I learned that from some old people at church. I was like, what? Y'all get y'all gotta pay taxes? She said, yeah, it don't make no sense. I don't work hard. She was pissed off. I'm just giving y'all the, I'm just showing y'all. We don't get taught these things. I'm just I'm just here. Alright? They need to put me in a Harriet Tubman movie and do a little financial Harriet Tubman. I've been running around here trying to save everybody. I'm just being real, guys. I'm trying to make it fun. But I'm being serious. So how do you get plugged in? It's 235 to get started to learn how to make sure make to set yourself free. Alright? $235. You're gonna get access to an amazing academy. Alright? Matter of fact, let me bring it up for you. What is Instagram looking like? About to kick us out yet? Two minutes. You can go ahead and cancel Instagram. We're gonna press, we're gonna end it and restart it. They have a limit on uh the live feed. So we're gonna end it and come right back on in 10 seconds, alright? You can go ahead and cut it B. Alright. If y'all getting some value on tonight, Facebook, please drop some fives in the chat box. I got five on it. If you get some value tonight, drop some fives in the chat box. Right? Y'all with me? All right, so this is what I need y'all to do. We're going to end this thing. We good, we good on Instagram? I ain't the best dancer in the world, y'all. My sister is. I can't. Here we go. So I need y'all to download Meditrator 4. Okay, don't forget that. And I need you guys. There we go. It's on TV. It's on TV. Download Meditrator 4. This is the money app. This is the financial, this is the instrument that you can use to create wealth. Uh, there's other apps out there called Robinhood, Acorn, and things of that nature, right? A lot of people, it's over 60 million of those accounts. Most people don't have make no money in those accounts because they don't know what to do. Or got messages coming in. <laughs> Secondly, you're going to get access to the Foreign Exchange Academy. I'm going to teach you how to trade by analyzing the markets, digital currencies, all right? Everything is in this academy. Everything is pre-recorded. Pre-recorded videos to get to learn how to trade. Basic, intermediate, and advanced. You do not have to have, you can have zero knowledge. Guys, I had zero knowledge two and a half years ago. I didn't know nothing about this stuff. But I knew my power. I knew I had to go. And I knew I was dissatisfied with where I was. Because if I kept doing what I was doing, I was going to be in the same situation. Alright? This is what the Meditrator 4 looks like when you start making money. A little fuzzy on this thing. All right? I know it's fuzzy, guys. I don't know why, because my screen is fine. 50 cent investment grew to $28. This is what the market looks like when it's moving without your participation. Remember, the foreign exchange rate, those prices are fluctuating without you. So this is how currency grows. It can also look red like that, all right? Let me show y'all the red right quick. This is a demo account I was playing with. I left it wide open so people can see this is the demo we opened on Monday. I was leaving things. This is called floating. These things were floating. I didn't have a start. I mean, I didn't have an end to it. I just let them float. So I can let people see. All these was blue two days ago. But if you leave it wide open, you don't tell it to take it out and set out automatically. Or you don't close it out. You can close it out uh, manually as well. I can close it out. Close with a loss. If you don't do that, it's just going to be floating. All right? But I don't want y'all to get all the hype because y'all see blue. I want to show you. If you don't learn this skill set and you don't under your risk management, this is what can happen. All right? Now, some, you know, depending on your account balance, you can handle that type of risk. You're going to get access to the Foreign Exchange Academy. You're going to get access to a high frequency academy with goals over indices, Dow Jones, and cryptos, binaries. You're going to get access to our cryptocurrency academy. We have over 100 educators outside of myself as well that's going to be teaching you how to trade. You get to learn from the best. We are the best. Join Generation Wealth. I guarantee you, you'll learn how to trade if you're coachable, teachable, and you have a goal. This is not about the money. It's about your why. We're also going to give you trades while you're learning how to trade. What does that mean? I'm going to tell you when to press buy or sell. I'm going to give you the take profit. I'm going to give you the stop loss so you can make money while you're learning. All right? No income claims. Copy, paste, and potentially profit. Mentorship, you get to learn and earn on the go, ladies and gentlemen. All right, these are some of our amazing leaders. They went from zero to hero, all right? We also have a scholarship program. If you know two people right now, how many of y'all know two people who don't have the Meditrator 4 on their phone? How about that? Me, 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 me. How many of y'all know two people who don't even have Meditrator 4 on their phone? They don't even know what it is. All right, drop a one in the chat box if that's you. All right, guess what? If you know two people, two people only, all right? The company says if you refer two people, you get to learn and earn for free. All right? 
So what does that mean? It's 2.35 to get enrolled. Can you Instagram see me? 2.35. If you don't have 2.35 or 2.35 is a lot of money, it will always be. Why? Because you can't attract what you, what you think is a lot. I'm going to say that again. You cannot attract what you think is a lot. The reason you don't have $235 is because you think $235 is a lot of money. You become what you think about, all right? And your words create your world. You got to be careful. I don't have $235. No, I'm so happy and grateful. I'm going to get $235. God, I, I am $235. Our goal, the, the, the initial enrollment is $235. You get access to the education, the mentorship, the copy paste of profit, products and services, and um, live trainings, and uh, an amazing community here in Generation Wealth. Every 30 days, it's 174. Even if you don't have it right now, just put it on your to-do list. It's not for you to get started tonight. This is a this is mandatory almost because you need. To, there is no other financial vehicle in the world that will allow you to create wealth regardless of the economy status. Because guess what? When housing crashes, there's a decline. When when you can't, but when people are selling their houses off, when people are trying to get their cars repoed, right? People can't afford different things. Guess what? There's a decline. Okay. So our goal for you. Get started for 235. That's mandatory. But our goal for you is two options. The first one, make $5.80 a day. That's this. Over 30 days. Copy paste a potentially profit. No income claims. No, I'm not making no guarantees. But I want to let you guys know if I got a guy that can take a dollar to set for five figures, you can take a dollar to ten dollars. Alright? Guess what? Second, you can do our scholarship program. It's called two and free. Alright? Remember, this is not for everybody. I don't want somebody who's money hungry. I want somebody who's freedom hungry. Because you have to have the goal in mind. Y'all got to know what you want. What is your why? Why would this? Why would you want this opportunity to work? And and saying and you got to say, well, if it's just two thirty five is a lot of money, that's the wrong thing to be thinking about. That's the wrong question. That's a horrible mindset. Because if you don't do this and you can't go back to work for six months, what are you going to be doing? If you don't do this and you go back to work for six months, what does your life look like in six months? And you don't do this. All right? This is not for everybody. I'm looking for the willing. I'm looking for those who want to create wealth. I want to, I want to celebrate somebody else's retirement date. Mine is April 6, 2018. What's going to be yours? I've been doing this for two and a half years. What price are you willing to pay? Two and free. So what's a two and free? Let's go back to the TV. Two and free means if you have two people that want to learn this skill set with you. All right, who don't have Meditrader 4 on their phone, the company is going to terminate that 174 monthly tuition. Bump it, eliminate it, erase it. 235 to get started. You have two people within the next 30 days when you get started. It's two and free. Please do me a favor though. If you know those two people, don't go talk to them. You don't know nothing yet. Don't say anything to them. Just say, B, shoot me a text message, shoot me a DM. Drop GW in the comments right now if you if you if you feel like this is something that you can win in. Drop a GW in the comments right now if you know you can win in this opportunity. Don't drop anything if you're still fearful. All right, but if you know two people that want to, I mean they don't have you know two people that you know that will come in and learn a skill set and be able to create financial freedom. Guess what? They're going to terminate their monthly tuition. Refer two people. See, when you go to an apartment complex, they said they're going to give you $250 for referring somebody to a compartment. If you go to Cash App, they said they're going to give you $5. Right? What's some other referrals, B? If you go to the barber, they say, hey, bro. Apartment. I'm going to give you a, a free uh, a free cut if you if you refer your friend. I'm going to give you a $25 gift certificate. I know a lot of beauticians that do this. It's incentives for you to share the opportunity. The biggest marketing is word of mouth. <coughs> Black, what's that? Black Panther came out. All these movies come out, right? Social media, thank God for communication because we can find out about anything these days. But anyway, just those two people one time and that's it, guys. You get to learn for $235, learn and earn for free. All right, that's absolutely powerful. Now, this says $225 to $325. It's actually, we have a, uh, it's actually a $9 increase, $235 and $335. The $335 gives you access to all of our copy, paste, profit, mentorship, and education. The $235 gives you access to uh, certain copy, paste, and profits, education, and mentorship. All right. The thing is, um, yeah, it's just a nine dollar increase. Okay. And outside of that, um, you can get paid, share this opportunity, 
But I don't tell nobody to do that unless they willing to to partner with me and really bless the lives of other people. I've been have I've been able to help over 100 people get set free right now. All right, I've been able to help a lot of people. I got a young lady. She was able to uh, to purchase a home with this opportunity. She's on her way to a significant stream of income. All right, I have a couple of people. I had a young man. He's 17 years old right now. He's going to be able to be able to walk away. Whew. He's going to be able to have a retirement date before he gets his high school diploma. All right, youngest student is seven and a half years old. All right. And um, she's learning with us right now. So you got to ask the right questions. Are you financially prepared for today and for your 80th birthday? <laughs> all right. You got to ask that question. Don't be a reactive person. All right. Don't be a person where a crisis happens again and then you call me. You got to think now. Remember, this is not the digital have to start tonight. I mean, if you want to start tonight. Shoot me a DM in, in Facebook. If you're ready to start tonight, shoot me a DM in Instagram and say, get started or say GW or something like that. All right. But last but not least, just save up your income to be prepared for the 235. All you need is 235. That's all you need to get started and start learning this information. There are other, other opportunities out there. $27,000 for another opportunity here in Atlanta that teaches you how to trade. Twenty-seven dollars for a five to 10 day course. All right. You can go online to different places. Guys, we want to keep this thing simple. If you want to create generational wealth, you want to be around a faith-led community. You want to be around a fun community. We just went to London. We're about to go to Houston in, the, in the September. Guys, we're setting people free. I want to know what your why is, all right? You got to decide who you're going to become, all right? You got to decide who you're going to become. You're going to be the same person today, or you're going to be a different person right after I say different person. <laughs> anyway, thank y'all for chiming in. My name is B. Burrell. If you want to get started, just shoot me a message and say, B., just put, put freedom. If you want to get started, DM me freedom. That's all I want to know. Who ready to be free? All right. I love you guys. Thank you so much for time, chiming in. This ends our boot camp. Woo! Friday boot camp. I've been on this thing live every day. I appreciate y'all. That's it. Tag your friends. Who? Tag Ooh. your family. Ooh. Hold on, B. Tag your friends. Tag your family. We got five episodes. Go back. Go back down my feed. Instagram, go to Facebook. You get some, you get some playbacks. Well, we'll be uploading it to YouTube so people can get an understanding. I broke down a lot in other classes. All right, lot sizes. All right, meditator four. All right, risk management. I feel like I'm still in the robot class. Y'all might need buckling like a mother right now. <laughs> Let's go! Freedom, freedom, freedom date. Freedom, freedom, freedom date. Freedom, freedom, freedom date. I want to lay the date. Two.